Ordering numbers. Please, waiter, can I have a seven? No, not that type of ordering. What we mean by ordering numbers is putting them in order of size. So the smallest number going up to the largest number. In this video, we're going to look at ordering large numbers and then seeing the difference between these key words. These five numbers were easy to order, but it's sometimes a little trickier when the numbers are all large and look quite similar. For numbers like these, you might find it easier to put them into a place value table. So let's put our eight numbers in and see what we get. So looking at each column, starting with the tens of thousands, these three are the biggest numbers. So now looking at the thousands column for these three, four is the biggest, so that's the largest number. Now moving along to the hundreds column, nine is bigger than eight, so that's our next largest number. OK, so now let's order the final four numbers. The nines are biggest. They both have an eight, so moving on to the tens. Eight is bigger than five, so 9,884 comes next, followed by 9,854. And on to the final two numbers. Nine is bigger than five, so 8,954 is our next number with 8,594 being the smallest. Of course, you don't necessarily need to write out the columns and instead can just line up the numbers, one on top of the other, so it's easy to see which units correspond to one another. Your turn. Pause the video and order these four numbers. Did you get them in the right order? So ordering numbers is easy enough, and usually the question is easy to understand. It says smallest to largest, but it might otherwise use words ascending or descending. So what's the difference between ascending and descending? Ascending order means to go up, so starting with the smallest number on the left and go up to the biggest number. And yep, you guessed it, descending order is the opposite. It means to go down, so order the numbers from largest to the smallest. A simple way to remember which words mean what, the A for ascending points up, and the D for descending means down. Sometimes they try and make ascending and descending number questions a little trickier. Simply work out what the numbers are, and then put them into order second. Your turn. Pause the videos and answer these questions. Did you get them all correct? So ascending means up and descending for down. These words are a tiny bit trickier when negative numbers are involved. We will look at ordering negative numbers and ordering fractions and decimals in other videos. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. Comment below if you have any questions. Why not check out our Fusco app as well? Until next time.